Okay, in this video I'm going to show you how to find the center of a circle given two arcs. Excuse me, I'll say it again. I'm going to show you how to find the center of a circle given two chords that are not parallel in a circle. Okay? So basically the theorem says something like this. If you take the perpendicular bisector, all right, remember what that means. A bisector cuts a chord exactly in half. So this chord is exactly four centimeters. So let's cut it right in half. And then the perpendicular bisector forms a 90 degree angle with that. All right, so let's go ahead and draw a 90 degree angle. And there we go. And basically now that is a 90 degree angle. There's a perpendicular bisector. If you take the perpendicular bisector of both of the chords, let's do that, and it just turns out that this particular chord is also four centimeters. And let's go ahead and draw the perpendicular on that as well. And there we go. Where the two perpendicular bisectors meet is the center of the circle. Okay, so let's go ahead and write that up a little bit more formally. So, given two non parallel chords in a circle, the intersection. of the perpendicular, remember this is a symbol for perpendicular bisectors, bisectors of the chords will be the center of the circle. Okay, so that's one real interesting fact about finding those perpendicular bisectors. The other interesting fact is that this arc and this arc will also be equal. Okay, if the chords are the same length, then the arcs are the same length as well. Okay, I hope that was helpful.